Hello everybody, a hearty welcome to you all, I'm Secret and thank you for joining me in our let's play of Hearts of Iron 4 as the German Empire in World War 1. Всем привет, дорогие друзья, меня зовут Secret, давайте поиграем в День Победы 4 за Германская империя на первой, на первой мировой войне. На первой мировой войне. Und herzlich willkommen, meine Freunde, meine Damen und Herren, zu unserem großartigen Kaiserreich mit zwei Wortwürdig Kaiserreich als das deutsche Kaiserreich im Ersten Weltkrieg. Well, uh, my plan was to achieve a breakthrough in the front, in the uh, Western Front against France. This uh, happened already, but it's a minor breakthrough. So let's see. The episode will be named Breakthrough in the West. If we manage to, well, if we manage to establish a proper breakthrough and expand the French line. Also, we have to liquidate Dutch resistance here in the west. This contains probably like how many divisions? If you zoom out, like 79 divisions is there. That's insane much. That can't be that much. Let's say roughly like 20, 20, like 30 divisions we are going to get here. Uh, and selecting them, great. Continue our game. The Brits are loading focus on Marines. That's good, that's good. The front is simply green superior. Let's great check the front here. Uh, you are moving out. Well, here your line of advance will be modified. Um, here, come on! I wanna modify it. Come on, man! Yeah, there we go. Yeah, create a new line of advance for you, which is just into the coast. Yeah, don't go for it. 22 divisions, not 22, here 24 will be assigned to the task. Going and executing there. Here yeah, encircling that. Yeah. Enemy division capturing that area. Here. I have very many units here, that's for sure. I don't need that money, that's simply heavily overkill to be honest. Still, we can just do it. Run it after all. Let's simply attack that unit, so therefore overrun that. The holdings there. Let's go to Port, Port Elizabeth. Or the reinforced Port Elizabeth, how it seems like. Oh. That is doing it to move up. You also move up there. There you yeah, capture Cape Town. If you capture Cape Town, the South Africans should collapse. There the Japanese have some units. It's not so good though. You would go inside there, liquidate all units in that region. They're retreating, I want to cut them off here and win that front for us. Here you are doing good progress in Africa, pushing with our army. Well, the Brits have lots of units here, like their main bulk is probably here. <laughs> Most likely, yeah, I concentrate it in Africa. Okay, there, well, I wouldn't mind of the Ottoman expeditionary force, to be honest. Because the Ottomans can't do Oh shit, the army is too weak. Here, they have only nine military factories. Well, they're the same amount like Britain, but I don't know why they have such a bad. Well, I don't know. Here, um, we didn't achieve a major breakthrough yet, although we pushed deep inside this territory. That's good, that's good. Infrastructure is looking all green, so that's looking sporty as well. Uh, Romania didn't join the war, uncertainly. They didn't join it, so I really don't know why. They hate us. They just joined the war, to be honest. Uh, I really don't know why they should join the war at one point. I mean, that's for sure. They didn't join it right now. Well, I deployed the majority of my forces here. So, I'd really, I'd really not like it if they wouldn't do anything then. Okay, what's that? That's a garrison. So we really, we've done the building back that railway, but I wanna. Oh yeah, let's get the area from the Austrians. Us for control of state. Let's get everything, but not East Macedonia. Will they give it? Yep, they will. Great. Eleventh army. Eleventh army. Eleventh army is standing there. Twenty-four and twenty-nine Austrian troops. Yeah. I don't know why this would be... Okay, 
I wanted to send them into Africa, I think, yeah, I did I get a bit, I think, yeah. Therefore, send you into Chetin, Chetin, yeah, and then into Africa. And I have to occupy this area, therefore I will, well, I need more garrison units. Let's recruit more, do we have, oh, we don't have infantry equipment, that's a problem then, I can't produce it, unfortunately. Mm, I have to... I have 24 units and 24 here. I'll get the uh, half of my units split up from that area just to garrison these provinces in order to use its rifle industry. Yeah, they're doing it. I will even yeah, get, yeah, occupy, create a higher occupation. I don't need manpower to be honest, of Serbia. But I want the factories. Yeah, let's say harshest for Montenegro as well as harshest for Serbia. There we go. Yep, we can afford it. Here, let's select. Yeah, I can't be from Bulgaria yet. Only after the first of June 1915, that's possible. Well, let's go for the Africa call. Yeah, Africa call. Why not? Asian call. Well, Asian call, not Africa. I'll go for it. We have three military factories. Well, I need lots of weapons. Lots of weapons. Therefore, I'll queue in even one more line of weapons because it's really, really important to have a good stockpile of weapons available. Otherwise, my dear, that can go to the last queue, to be honest, because I have other important stuff to do as well. Great. South Africa did capture white. South Africa did capture white. Let's liquidate this last unit here. And we can, yeah, create a new army, firstly, yeah, 14. No, no, don't go from all the way there, here. Yeah, your new belly go after killing that unit will be, like, halt for now. This will attack, yep. Yeah. Here, yeah, this should be quite easily done, and we shouldn't have a naval invasion there. Yeah, I'm gonna... Yeah, these units will be detached, detached, because they are cleanse up the territory in other words and here pff, that's one unit basically the rest attack these units yeah. give them no way to break free that's great then we can release these units for the front oh French French it's looking bad for France well, I don't know if Austrian units will manage it here it's occupation in East Montenegro Minus four, minus minus zero, minus zero. Yeah, military factory sabotage, that's not good. Nevertheless, what's that? A British landing? Is that true? How? I have to just got a report, do I? Fucking hell. Yeah. I don't know why. A naval invasions in World War One aren't really that often they give you uh, the points. Well, the Brits don't want to give up their possessing there. Well, they will at one point. They will. They will. Well, the Ottomans. Why Ottomans? Why are you so... I don't know. Well, you need to execute, of course. Yeah, go into territory. Advance aggressively. That's how it should be. Great, so we have 13 free divisions. Yeah, only one going to capture Port Elizabeth. Yeah, okay, you can't go start directly. Detach. Okay, that's done already. Therefore, cancel it. The Ninth Army. Ninth Army. I'll send you up to World Extract the Infrastructure. It's well, already everywhere. We can send it up wherever we would like to. Therefore, I'd say. Uh, where the 12th Army? 12th Army is doing there. The 4th Army is right there. 15th is there, 9th is idle, 7th, 8th, 8th, let's add 6 more, we need to the 8th army, 6 more to the 8th army, yep, and then 
let's combine this army as well as you two. And we have 13 divisions here. Abyssina. I don't know to be honest. I want to go into that Ottoman territory. Yeah, let's send them up here. Let's justify against Ethiopia, actually, although they are authoritarian. I don't know, let's just send it up there, I guess. Ottomans, yeah, they captured the port of Benghazi. Well, that easily, I'm really disappointed by them. That's controlled by our army. Minus five here, uh, cool down. I can send you to the East Montenegro. It's plus O, plus O. Here. Do I have to do it all on my own? Apparently, yeah. Alright, that should be fine. Netherlands, no breakthrough yet. 153 divisions of armor group. West, come on, breakthrough, breakthrough. 92 attack there. Not defending well, but our reserves are simply superior. We lost 821,000 uh, people already. The allies lost far less, but we can afford it, they cannot. Yeah, go to them, attack them. Looking so far so good. Yeah, if we do get it, there will be a major encirclement. We still have air supremacy above northern France as well as above the Benelux region. The Allies cut off their air power completely. Why? With why our region? I don't know. Okay, now here Austrian troops. I will detach three just to garrison the area. So, but once Truppen, you will be in the. I'll spread you out evenly to the armies 10 yeah, to the 15th army and to the 15th army and 9 more to the 4th army pushing Tunisia that's how Germany should have acted as well in World War <laughs> 1 yep. go that's about it now these three where are they? Kras wants to open these three let's go into here and knock off the British Getting reinforced. Well, Ottomans were about attacking that before it's getting reinforced. It's unbelievable, really. Okay, naval invasion. Nine six. At one point, we'll break through. Well, Romania, join the war. Come on. I'm sure the allies are promising you some good lands. Go for it. Meanwhile in Africa, yeah, we have the 7th army completely idle, and the 7th army is completely idle. The 7th army, well I don't know where to assign them actually to. Look, German Empire, let's see which is this. Yeah, well, assign them to the, I guess, Egyptian region here. That's front line, just attacking to Egypt. There we go, now they are redeploying strategy. Strategically, yeah. I'll modify the front line actually because they are pushing the French coastline here. Therefore, do it like that. I like that, fine. Should be good. Let's go. Nice, that's how I like it. Resist occupation in Cape. Oh, the board commandos can guard Cape, yeah. Cape. This was this region. Scanning, yeah. Resistance. Pretoria will surely gain it as well. Gain resistance. The reserve division. The brigades. That's the vision. I have so many oil divisions, let's send them down because I think we'll have to yeah, garrison the area. 
long will stay here. Just because I have this feeling of actually going and capture this port. Yeah, they have a port here. Oh, the Kingdom of Italy has joined the United Kingdom as our enemy in austro hungarian serbian war. There we go. Italy is officially our enemy now. Therefore, enabling our... Well, we have a really good defensive position here. Therefore, crippling the Italians. As well, we have we are mountain troops, so therefore don't forget that. Oh, we captured what? We captured Holland and Rotterdam, but forced the Germans to retreat into Holland. Into you know, Holland. Yeah, not the Germans. The Dutch. Frontline is stiffening, getting more resistance. After we you know, release our troops here, our foreign divisions, it should well, go more fluently. Or again, Amsterdam. Well, not so good. Finally, well, only five expeditionary forces. I'm pretty. I would have expected more from here, the Ottomans. Disappointed. Yeah. Deleted. Not. Put more speed for my allies. No point of that. Uh, we are capturing British victory points. British victory points are getting in our hands. And push. Push the Brits. Uh, the war in Africa is looking great. Look to that. Central powers at Antoine. We kind of dominate the African battlegrounds. Well, here it's horrible. Our units here can't do really much. I'll have to focus them to the upper front. Do it like that. We have to capture the region where we can actually move out first. Well, this will guard Benghazi, you will guard Tripoli as well. We need to guard the ports of Italy to ensure no invasion as well as Tunisia. Tunisia got under Ottoman control. Cool to that. The Ottoman Empire is getting big again. What's that? The Dutch, yeah, I really hate that. That's fucking naval invasions. Let's cut them off before they can uh, get anything. Come on, go for it. Yeah. Should cut them off quite rapidly. Now there's a major settlement. Now really easy, really easy, fine. You have to stand there and garrison the area. They have lost place. I'll detach one more infantry division. Move you into there, and then they'll do a good task of pushing the Brits. Yeah, well, it's not really realistic to see a naval invasion, but I mean, it's really gay. What should we do? Well, let's regain some organization. After the regain, just go for it. What's we are doing? Infrastructure effort. And the storm make good efforts. Inland as well, infrastructure. Hmm. We're well, defending quite well. Should we go into the offensive? I don't know actually. Lost convoy, fine. Can it happen? Yeah, I want the Romanians to take a side. Romania, join us or be against us. I don't like that. Yeah, we're pushing them really well. Oh, the Brits. We penetrated, well, quite deep here. Our armor group is doing a tremendous effort. Tremendous good effort. I think we're defending quite well as well. Well,. I'm gonna send, yes, yeah, since the Romanians are taking a side, these 24 Austrian divisions will get deployed to the Italian front. Same belly go, same belly go. Deployed, and then I have two, well, divisions here. Only 12 divisions guarding the Romanian front, which would be fine because I can fastly, fast, simply redeploy them. Therefore, that should be alright. Just take a defensive here. Yeah. With a supreme spur of general, it should propose no problem. Actually, they're gonna replace here with the 
the honorable of the Austro-Hungarian army because you are simply superb von der Marwitz an a sign you will get von der Marwitz von der Marwitz you will get then general yeah them. Okay, the Italian front, the French divisions are getting more and more, I don't like that, although the French industry, well, is really weak, I don't know, well, we'll win the war of attrition for sure, that's for sure, and the USA is unrestricted submarine war response, and they are, I don't know, declaration of war to Germany, well, they can only join the Entente if they yeah, let's improve our relations with the US to avoid their entrance into the war. Just I'll just keep it improving always. And they don't like us because of the world tension. Yeah, I really can't uh, change that, unfortunately. The opinions. We cause too much world tension, 46.1%. Well, it isn't that much, come on. I mean, if they capitulate to us, it isn't a problem. It isn't our problem, in other words, but what should we do? There's a border conflict, that's interesting. Africa is simply looking superb. We are doing a goddamn hell job in Africa. Let's just have one more unit, so one each, one more each of these provinces. Yeah. South Africa is nominally under German rule. Let's say in other words, yeah. Okay, and here we're going to capture that port. That's Angola. It's fully on our control. Why aren't they pushing? I need to remodify the front actually. With these units, these units. Let's see, how many did I select even? Well, these are. Uh, Apparently two armies, two different armies. Well, let's do that later. I'll take a break. Here, yeah, look to the front. It's all green. And, well, we did achieve a breakthrough in the West. Belgium did fall to our hands. Netherlands kind of as well. So, thank you all for watching. I'm Sacred. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more. And I'm out. Have a nice day to you all.